Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Movie Sense. I'm your host, DJ Selby, and I have with me as almost always, Mark Flores. Ladies and gentlemen, Mark Flores here. I'm excited, pumped, ready to get in the ring with Creed 2. I like that. That was really... I like that. That was clever. I am very excited about this movie trailer reaction because uh, we did the first one actually I did it within the first couple hours it was released uh, to the viewers previous and in, uh, in those past episodes I explained that I come from a Rocky family huge Rocky fan the whole cinematic universe including five how about you I like the Rocky movies when I was uh, about 12 or 13 years old I went out of my way and actually bought the first Rocky movie watching it in its entirety yeah and uh, it even won Best Picture, 1976 Best Picture. I know. So that's actually a nice little yeah. tidbit right there. Written by Sylvester Stallone. Yes. So, let's get into it. Very excited. The trailer for Creed 2, Trailer 2. Is it too late to say that Frank Stallone, his brother, was the one singing in the beginning of Rocky? No, it's not too late to no. say that. There's a, cheap, there's a cheap Frank Stallone cameo in Rocky. Nice. Let's get into it. We don't do what we love. Then we wouldn't exist. Oh yeah. yeah. Gets you excited, yeah, doesn't it? It does. It's like nothing really matters to him right now. Oh, there she is. Including me. You gotta think real hard about this. So you got people that need you now. I'm taking the fight. Victor Drago, son mm, of oh, Ivan Drago, Drago, who infamously Drago. killed Apollo nice. Creed, appeared Drago today Senior. to issue a challenge to Adonis Creed. Don't do this. I ain't got a choice. Uh, That's the same thing his original father house? said. Yeah. He died right We're here back in, in Philly, you guys. Kind of that kid was raised in hate. It's dangerous. He broke things in me that ain't never been fixed. It ain't worth it. It's not just us anymore, Dave. I want to rewrite history. Still if you want to shit. fight this man, that's yeah. your business. But don't pretend this is about your father. I think some of the same lines are from Black Panther when he played Killmonger. This hip is all about my life, my kids, the life that I live through the night. I was his, it was right, but I did my arms and down. My slips, my walls, my trials and tribulations, my heart, the blood was This won't be the end of me. We're you. It can't be, because we're a team. I don't know what you're fighting for. There's so much bad Brown blood in that room. Brown. I know. Learn more about yourself. Is this a step in that race? It wasn't all about me. That looks enticing. I'm very interested to see it. Uh, it really reels you in like the first Creed. And you know what? The formula, even decades after the last Rocky movie, uh, Rocky Balboa, you're still enticed by the same formula of the every man trying to achieve the impossible and doing it big. Yeah, and you know what I want to point out is that coming from you know the whole universe of Rocky, watching it, being a fan, I got to say that if this was a cash grab type of thing that they were doing, because they are bringing back Victor Drago, uh, our Ivan Drago and then Victor Drago the son is in there so we have Dolph Lundgren we have yeah. Sylvester Stallone you know we're bringing back those original characters is that a cash grab idea I'm not sure but it's working for me because it's that nostalgia factor right. it's the nostalgia of the two main competitors and then you got the son of the fallen one Apollo so that's exciting to me if it is a cash grab move I mean, it it won in my in my you know perspective because it got me it won yeah. me over. I hope it's not that type of flick. You know, we don't have Ryan Coogler directing it right. uh, like previous. He is part of the writing team. He's part of the producing team. But um, I am still excited about this movie. So so Adonis Creed is just going to start taking out the sons of 
the people, the people, <laughs> the, the, so, the, yeah. the people that Rocky has defeated in the previous movies. He's Mr. T's sons. Yeah, Clubber just, Lang Jr. Clubber is going to show up next. Gonna show. What, what's his name going to be? Double Lane? <laughs> That was a stupid joke, but anyway, uh, like I mentioned, it was it's not gonna be Ryan Coogler who directed. Which, by the way, Ryan Coogler did make his flame, his flame, his fame by uh, Fruitvale Station, then did Creed, and then Black Panther. I mean, these are three box office flicks that have high critic raves. And I mean, he's not part of this one, which is kind of sad, and you know, for me. But he's still writing, he's still producing. No, is this movie gonna live up to the hype? We still got the main characters we still got Tessa Thompson Michael B. Jordan Sylvester Stallone now we got Dolph Lundgren added into it yeah. Felicia Rashad she's in is still playing the mother of Adonis Creed so what are you thinking I'm thinking that this movie is going to be great it's going to follow the same fashion as the first Creed the first Creed puts a big sense of realism like you are right over the shoulder of Adonis Creed that whole movie and right. I hope to I hope that they capture that, that same vibration shadow. Yeah, exactly. Living in the shadow of his father. Now he's not living in the shadow of his father. He's made a name for himself, but now he's trying to seek almost like is it is he avenging his father's he's death? He's trying to get that. Is he doing some sort of a poetic avenging? justice, you know? Something like that. To where, you know, I want to do what my dad couldn't do. Not just not try to beat <laughs> the old Drago cuz that'd be useless but actually beat his son up that'd be funny if he like attacked the old Drago <laughs> and like, like a mention at a shady pines retirement home <laughs> <laughs> beats him up first Ivan and Drago's then that's why Drago wants to coach I, his son I mean Drago's watching reruns of Expendables 1 through 3 like i mentioned to you in the in, in the trailer reaction there's a lot of bad blood you got Rocky who beat Drago you have Drago who killed the son uh killed the father of the son who was his son is fighting and then you have Adonis Creed who wants to beat up the guy who killed his dad. This is a lot of tension going on in that ring. And I hope, and I just hope that they actually bring in and make it noted that that bad blood gets brought into the brought into the ring like a good third act that actually, or a good climax that actually brings up another reason why there is such intensity in that ring. Because yeah. I, I think there's going to be something that actually puts that all over to a boiling point. So you think that it's going to have this boiling point, there's going to be this huge climactic finish, and there we go. We, we get that ending that we all want. I kind of think they're going to go in a different direction. I kind of feel like maybe Adonis might lose this round or lose, I mean, the match. And uh, he showed heart just like Sylvester showed heart when he first fought Apollo and lost, yeah. you know. So then they kind of become friends or something. Like I can picture something like that happening. Yeah, where he actually – Rocky doesn't want to take the fight. So he co gets other coaches and then loses the first time. Yeah, sure. Yeah. I mean, who knows? I'm excited though. Nonetheless, this has been a Creed 2 trailer reaction by uh, your boys DJ and Mark here. And if you have any comments, please leave them below. Please let us know how you feel about this movie. Yeah. Tell us what you think about the first Creed movie, and uh, we'll respond to you. Yeah. And L uh, Let us know in the comments who you want us to punch. Well, I don't know if that's a good idea, but if you want to... or if which, that, one of, which one of us would you want to see Michael B. Jordan other. punch? Which one? <laughs> which one? Because we can call him. We have access to his agent. We just got to sign up for IMDb Plus. Uh, but anyway, uh, Mark, how about you do that thing that we love watching you do? Ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank you for watching another great episode of Movie Sense. Like always, please be sure to like, share, and most importantly, please subscribe. Yes. And don't forget to follow us on Instagram at This Is Movie Sense. But when you do, make sure you use the hashtag This, this Is Movie Sense. Sense. Goodbye.